What's going on guys? Welcome back to... I mean, not welcome back. Welcome to our brand new series, Pokemon Red Randomizer Nuzlocke version 721, I believe. Now, in this Nuzlocke, um, it is basically uh, all Pokemon up to Generation 6. So, we're going to see about that. Wow. This is going to be really weird having to talk for Professor Oak. Hello there, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the pro Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, pe Pokemon are pets. Others of them... them for, uh, uh, myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. First, what is your name? Alright, so we're gonna actually do this quick because we want to get through the dialogue for uh, quick. This is my grandson. He's been a rival since you were a baby. Um, what's his name again? We're gonna go with our regular um, rival, as usual, because Garrett is one of our friend, one of my friends, who likes to be com completely competitive against me. I don't know why. That's right. I remember now. His name is Garrett. Rampage. Your your very own Pokemon Legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventure with Pokemon awaits you. Let's go. Okay, let's see. There's usually an item in this PC. Okay, we got a rare candy. I guess it replaced the potion? We're just gonna speed up to the um, part where we talked. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is just him bringing us to the lab. And we all know that th the usual stuff here. I, sh I should be reading it, but. Um, I just don't feel like it. Okay, so our first choice is Ambipom. Okay. That's a good, ch that's a nice choice. Um, no, I'm not choosing Wobbuffet, I'm sorry. Last one is Buizel. You know what, I'm gonna go with Ambipom. Since this is a Nuzlocke, we're gonna nickname him, and... I know we won't be able to fit the entire name in here, so I'm just going to name him George. For Curious George. Okay, so... Let's get this show on the road. <laughs> I sped up too fast, but was that a hiker? Was that a hiker sprite? Oh my god. I shouldn't have sped up. I shouldn't have seen that. Let's see. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh my god. I, I can't I'm laughing so hard I can't even read the text. Oh. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon fight to toughen it up. Gramps, Rampage spell you later. Oh my god, this is insane. Okay, I just want to... Okay, there are wild Pichus in this grass. Now, I don't want to level up too much to be too overpowered so we can't catch our first encounter. So I'm gonna just run from a few of them. Make our way up to Viridian City so we can get the parcel for Oak. Now the only reason why I'm speeding this up is because, um... I... I honestly, like, I actually... have played the original Red, so I know how long and tedious and backtracking this could be sometimes, so. Holy crap! That would be insane if we got it on the, as our first encounter, but no thank you. Okay, we're gonna speed through him, giving the Pokedex. All right, so that's that's all it is really is him talking about giving the Pokedex, and then we can go get the time map from his sister now. All right, so further on, we'll we'll talk for every character. It's just the starting point. I didn't want to actually do anything, so let's go up here. Let's grab the item from this guy, whatever it is.
Me too again, holy cow. That's right, we gotta run. We don't wanna be able to one shot all the other Pokemon when we're trying to catch one. Okay, so we're gonna buy 15 Pokeballs. Can't, I don't know why we can't just hold it down to buy more. Alright, so let's go catch our first Pokemon. First encounter only, so let's see what we get. Survey says... It's Mewtwo. Oh my god, this is gonna be so hard, why? Why do they give us the hard one? Because Mewtwo's catch rate is insane. Okay, honestly, like, if I can't catch him within two Pokeballs, I'm just gonna kill him. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna kill him. There's no point in wasting Pokeballs on a Mewtwo. Like, I, I know that he's insanely powerful, but there's no point in wasting. So we're gonna go over here and get our encounter over here. Hopefully it's not another legendary, because that would be insane. So survey says... An Escavalier. It's not bad. Let's just hope. Ouch. Okay, so let's hope that we can catch it. Alright, we, we got it. So, um... So he is a knight style thing, so... Um... You know, we're gonna call him Joust. I don't know how to spell it, so... Excuse me if I actually am spelling it wrong. I'm wrong. Okay, so that is our first encounter there. Let's go heal up. Now, um... We're gonna switch him up to front. So he has a bug type. Let's see, what, it, what does he have? He has double-edged, twin needle, and leer, and peck. So it's not a bad, um... Uh, set. So let's get him a little bit leveled up. Let's go Twin Needle. We'll just speed up. I mean, you can get Blitzels in here too. Why couldn't I get that instead of Mewtwo? Speaking of Mewtwo. Amoongus as well. Wow. Okay. Okay, our Pokemon about to level? Yes, they are. Okay, so... Yeah, it is kind of like just a quick level up around here because... We are going to go fight our rival again. At the end of that other route. Okay, so there's a pincer. Another pincer. So I am going to level them up a little bit, at least up to level 10 each. That's right, I shouldn't be using double edge, really. A pan pour. That's interesting. So we're just speeding up a little bit while we level up to level 10. Shouldn't be much longer. There we go. Okay, so Joust is at level 10. Now we gotta get George up to level 10 at least. Scratch. Scratch. We're gonna be scratching everything for days. Just back and forth a little bit. Wow. So many Mewtwo's. That would have been insane to have. Come on, almost there. There we go, level 10. Now we're gonna go heal up and then go fight our rival. Now, there shouldn't be any more speeding up in this episode at least. Apart from this part, because I don't, because healing them up takes so long. All right, so let's head over to the route, uh, the route over here. Let's talk to our rival, well to battle our rival once again, see what kind of hilarious sprite he gets. Does he get the same sprite or does he 
keep changing any, either way. And also, I wonder if this Pokemon will always change. I'll have to find out. Hey, Rampage! You're going to the Pokemon League? Forget it. You probably don't have any badges. The guard won't let you through. But the way did... Uh, by the way, did your Pokemon get any stronger? Well, let's see. Does he get any funnier? Nope. <laughs> he's just a hiker. Oh, well. Okay, so he's got a Spritzy. That's not too bad, to be honest. Because, um... Aromatix is actually a pretty strong fairy type. I don't know if Ambipom actually learns any good moves in the weapon, so... Hariyama. Okay, that we are going to switch out for him. Because so his Pokemon always do change, so... That'll be actually kind of interesting to see how it turns out. Focus energy. Okay. He sand attacked. Oh, well, that's fine. You lucked out! Thanks for the money. I heard the Pokemon League has many tough trainers. I have to figure out how to get past them. You should quit dwaddling and get a move on. Alright, Mr. Slow Walker. Uh, uh, wow, we could have got a Seismitoad. Alright, so, wait, is there an item up here? No, there isn't. Wait, I just got a Max Elixir. Wait, or did... Oh no, I completely forgot. Wow, he caught a chancy in one shot. So, I believe this is a brand new route, so we can actually catch something here. But actually, let's check the town map just in case. Okay, so we're on route two. Yeah, that is a brand new route, so let's get our encounter right here. Survey says... I'm not mad. <laughs> like, Pidgey's kind of awesome. Well, Pidgeot. Of course. Um, we are going to switch out to Joust. Because I don't... Ah. Man, I thought we could have kept it alive. Oh, so we didn't lost our encounter there. Let's see if anybody here gives us anything. No. Okay, so Viridian Forest is our next encounter as well. So let's see what we get. For Viridian Forest. Come on. Are you seriously not going to give me anything? Okay, here we go. So, survey says... Flaffy. It's not horrible. Honestly, it isn't, but I don't want to kill it. Okay, you know what? Peck... Oh, we're paralyzed. Peck is, um... Resisted, so we can actually hit it a few times with Peck. Come on. There we go. I already have a name for uh, Flaffy Flash Ampharos. So we're going to call it Bo. Actually, I should be um, putting lowercase as well. Peep. Okay, so uh, actually, we're going to use a hurt candy on Bo Peep. Let's switch Bo Peep into the front. Let's see what we get here. Max Potion. That is kind of interesting. Whoa, I didn't want to go through there. Okay, so this way. Okay, so we're going to be coming up to some encounters here. Hey, you have Pokemon? Come on, let's battle him! Oh, I forgot. Oh, sorry to send out Buizel. Okay, um, do we... We do have Thundershock. Nice. That's fine, because we're using a special attacking move. 
He's out of there. Devotion. That's a psychic type, so yeah, we're gonna switch out. Oh, I switched out to the wrong one. Oh, well. Sprites look kind of cool, though, to be honest. Ouch. Not really. Some of these um, encounters are going to be kind of interesting, because they're all going to be different. You, you can't jam out if you're a Pokemon trainer. Actually, I don't, I don't usually read their text. Wow, he's got a level 7 Pidgeot. Okay. Okay, um... That should give us a lot of experience, I think. As long as this doesn't kill us. Oh god, that was close. Yeah, that gave us quite a bit of experience. Electros. Yes, we will switch. My god, that looks ugly. <laughs> Electros, what did they do to you? <laughs> Crunch. Oh my. Okay, so that's the end of Electros. That's level up for us. Uh, Kaimeko. Or Chimeko. It is psychic, so we're gonna bring out Joust. You know, with the Twin Needle. Let's see, does, does Rap still have the same effect? Yes, it does. So, we're gonna just speed that up because Rap is annoying. Thank you. Okay, so before we do anything, we're gonna head back and heal up because. Um, I don't want to be paralyzed anymore, of course. So up to now we've only lost two encounters worth, so... But we found some pretty awesome Pokemon on the way. Because we have, um... Bo Peep, which... It's, it's special is pretty higher than its attack, so that's good. It's definitely got a higher attack than special. So he's gonna be physical. And George is definitely physical as well. And he's really fast too. Wow. So. Oops. Can, can I just. Okay, I guess I can't look in one direction, so. Either way, it's going to end right here, so if you guys did enjoy, please show your support by stomping that like button, leave a comment, and also subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.